if I had any confidence in trying to game master, I would. <laughs> I, I would want. I want to try it at least once. I yeah. don't think. I legitimately do not think I'd be any good at it whatsoever. I mean, it's really just like harnessing your like chaotic dumb energy to like make up stuff on the fly. My problem though is that I, I think of like stupid or neat shit, and I go, "Ooh, that's good. I want to do that." And I like write down the broad strokes of the story. And then a year and a half goes by, and I've procrastinated doing the details. You know? <laughs> I'd probably get just desperate instantly and just reach into just it would just be my stream of consciousness, effectively. Yeah, I mean that's literally what happened for the uh, the one shot with the uh, bed dragon and the the final like Pegasus oh, yeah. battle. That was funny. Remember all that shit? Yeah, yeah. that ruled though. <laughs> that was just. That was stream of consciousness. That was just um. well, players come up with enough content on their own that I would have yeah. to modify too. It's improv. It's yes and, especially if you're oh, making God. shit on on the fly. It's yeah. yes and, especially if you're making up your shit on the fly, then fucking I mean, well, go with it. it. It's gotta be. Well, like, here, come on, we're we're doing this. We don't want to tell anybody who are you ideas. Oh, no. right now. I'm Bilbo Schmiggins. <laughs> oh my <laughs> God. Race class. Um, uh, why you do this um i am you do this i am half white and uh, i'm half <laughs> i'm half british white and half american white oh, no. okay so this and, is a fantasy campaign okay uh, i'm impoverished oh my god <laughs> all right martin who are you um mark Wahlberg. <laughs> <laughs> Mark I'm just Mark Wahlberg. All right, so how do you guys know each other? <laughs> Bilbo Schmiggins and Mark Wahlberg. <laughs> I don't know. Oh my god. Where are you and what are you doing? How do you I, know each I, other? I saw his movies, and yeah. I just kind of kept frequenting. Uh, you know, I used literally all my money earned through carpentry. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, to travel yeah. the country, yeah. hitting Wahlbergs, just road tripping across the united states oh yeah, yeah. and eventually i came into one where uh mark mark Wahlberg was doing a little meet and greet much like he does at his hyvee restaurant sometimes fantastic uh, and i i said hello all right i am Bill schmiggins what do you say mark Wahlberg? um fuck i don't know I don't he I, say that. I don't know how to play Mark Wahlberg. <laughs> I didn't think this through at all. You don't, have, you don't have to know how to play Mark Wahlberg. You can just I know, but it really should this actually be Martin, playing him. This is fantasy Mark Wahlberg, okay? Martin, you, know, you, Martin, Martin, you know how accurate Jim Sterling's celebrity impressions are, right? Yeah, but they've sort of become there like you. a thing of their own at this point. Uh, Mark Wahlberg's yeah. bouncer That's steps be what in the way doing. between the two of you. Excuse me, sir, do you have a pass? Oh, uh, it's okay. This guy looks cool. <laughs> oh, thanks. Thanks for saying I look cool. I mean... Yeah, man. You, you seem all right. <laughs> I mean... <clears throat> I know I'm all right, but cool. I mean, to be laid down by, by the walliest of all the birds. <laughs> you know... I'm, I'm just really, really flattered, man. Oh, well, you, you know... Know As you say. have this conversation, the uh, the bouncer sort of, you know, he nods and he retreats back into the into the shadows, oh. and he uh, he pulls his smartphone out and he starts uh, he glances around the room and he taps on it a little bit. <laughs> this is terrible. This is the worst. Very secretive. It's the worst thing. Very secretive. What do you do? Uh, hey, what are you what are you doing over there? What is this guy's name? Do I I should know his name, right? Yeah, his name is um Grandpa. Hey Grandpa, what are you uh <laughs> what are you doing? Oh hey boss, I'm a uh, I'm on my phone. Yeah. He puts his he puts his phone away real fast, like you know, he doesn't want you to see. What uh what are you like checking your stocks or something? Yeah, the, my stocks. Okay. Well I've invested in some of those lately. Yeah. Oh, uh, Wahlberg's restaurants. Oh, Wahlburgers. <laughs> oh, wow, man. Thanks. We're, we're in Matt right now, definitely. Yeah, we're in a Wahlburger right now. 
And what a Wahlburger it is. Yep. I'd like to investigate Grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> You, what do you mean investigate? How do you want to investigate Grandpa? <laughs> I don't know. I just, I just want to know what the hell he's doing. Um, uh, pick a number between one and four. Four. <laughs> wow, you rolled super high. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, you can see that he's being very, very suspicious and... Uh, with that four, you pull the, the phone out of his pocket with lightning speed, and uh, you see um, <laughs> you see that there's a single text message, an outgoing text message that says, he's here and he doesn't expect a thing. Go. What the fuck? Um, hey, hey, let, let go of my phone. Oh, sorry, man. Uh, uh huh. I don't know what to do now. <laughs> hey, uh, Mr. Wahlberg. Yeah. You know, your employee seems pretty disobedient. Uh, you know, if I were working for you, I would never take my phone out in my shift. Uh, I mean, you know, it's... Well, that's why you don't work here. And he, he takes a swing at you. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck, dude? Who, who, grandpa? <laughs> grandpa takes a swing at uh, Bilbo Schmiggins. Hey, I okay, said he's uh, cool. Don't mess with him. Okay, um, I guess, like, I'm gonna try, I'll try and dodge it. Do I got to roll for just dexterity? Yeah, or yeah. Give me a dex save. <laughs> um, pick a number between one and ten. Uh, six. His big hammy fist connects straight with your jaw. I I walk up to Grandpa and put my hand on his chest. Okay, I'm gonna oh, need you to. You are teleported to a magical land. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what is... Why is the world fades around you as you, you as his chest is to expand? <laughs> his chest seems to expand. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. As his chest seems to expand and envelop you. <laughs> <laughs> This is amazing. <laughs> what you the hear, fuck? You hear Grandpa's voice <laughs> as the world fades around you. Shouldn't have done. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Bilbo Schmiggins, you watch as Mark Wahlberg is absorbed into Grandpa's chest. <laughs> What do you do? <laughs> um, I mean, like, I'm I'm on the floor, right? I've just been slammed. Yeah, you got fucking cold by clock. that by that ham. Yeah, by um, the ham fist. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna do my best to compose myself. Okay. And then slowly slap. Takes my half hand. your movement. Takes half your movement to stand up. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It takes half my movement to stand up, and I use the rest of my movement then to just slam my hand, <laughs> just slap Grandpa right in the chest. Okay. Roll a, a wisdom saving throw. <laughs> <laughs> Pick a number between 1 and 20. Uh, well, you know, I'm just a simple carpenter, but, mm. you know, I, tra I traveled across America, so I've seen a thing or two, uh, and I roll a 20. <laughs> All right, so the number I was thinking of was 5, so... <laughs> <laughs> Is that what I actually rolled then? No, <laughs> you, know, you rolled a 20. Okay, but like, it would have been at least five to pass? No, no, I'm, this is, since this is, there's no dice here, I'm just doing like, how close are you to the number that I'm thinking of? Oh. oh okay, I see. Why are you handing this to me right now? Kim, take this back, I don't want this. Kim just walked in here and gave me my my tablet and the charging cable. Uh -huh. Hey Martin, um, the map the, the map for me is real fucked up. I see it like all the way across the background of the screen. Is that yeah. normal? Press tab. Tab. Um, oh, there we go. I was hitting all kinds of buttons. I've just been wandering around on this mine cart track for like the past twenty minutes, back and forth. Uh, hey, what's I... going on with uh, Grandpa? I need to know. <laughs> <laughs> 
I need to know um, what's happening. So Ben Ben failed his his wisdom saving throw pretty bad. So uh, he also sees Grandpa's chest expanding as he uh, fades into the darkness. Oh no! Okay, so I'm in this other world now, right? You did. I didn't say that. Yeah, you did. Oh yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> So like what 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 what's a, what is it? What's going on? Hmm. Uh, what country were you in before? America. That's where the wall. You're in America. Are. Okay, but so yeah, United yeah. States. Yeah. Okay. Um. America. Now now you're in um New Zealand. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Cool. Oh wait, no shit. Never mind. You're in Japan. You're in you're in um, Edo period Japan. Oh, oh shit. Boy. You're in the you're in the historical Japan episode of your Common Rider series. Oh no, oh, that's cool. And I can't get out of my minecart. Can he tell that he's in Japan? I mean, there are like you know, samurai walking by in like full armor. What the fuck? You're in a you're on a dirt road, and there's you know it's one of those like long straight roads with all the shops lining it on either side and. They're like, you know, uh, peasants walking by with carts full of, like, bags of, of dried rice. And um, there's, a, like, a, a like three three samurai, not in armor, but in, like, their, their normal garb. But they've got, like, their top knots and their swords and shit. And they start giving you a look because, obviously, you are out of place. I say to the nearest one, hey, buddy, is this a movie set or something? Nani Tendo. What? Uh. Hello? He speaks Japanese to you. Do I know it's Japanese? I. Bro, does, Mar does, does Mark Wahlberg know how <laughs> what Japanese sounds like? Um, Roll an intelligence check. Pick a number between 1 and 20. Uh. 13. All right. Yeah, you have a pretty good idea that it's Japanese. Holy shit. Your uh, acting must have taken you to Japan at some point. Yeah. Because otherwise it's impossible to know what Japanese sounds he, like. He probably worked with Ken Watanabe in some movies. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. How the hell did I get to Japan? Japanese, Ken Watanabe is your grandfather. Here's in movies. But he's not grandpa. <laughs> not grandpa. I said like grandfather, didn't right. I? Right. You did say <laughs> grandfather. So I got it. Yeah. Well, shit. <clears throat> what the hell do I do now? I don't speak Japanese. Uh, Where am I? Ko Konichiwa. <laughs> As you say that, Bilbo Schmiggins falls on you from nowhere. Oh. <laughs> oh, can I catch him in my arms like a badass since I'm Mark why Wahlberg? You, why don't you roll a dexterity <laughs> saving throw? Oh, shit. Number between 1 and 20. Um, I'm going to roll 3. I said I was thinking 20 that time, so... <laughs> oh, fuck. So that time he, he falls on you and... Um, Ow. Yeah, I think you both probably take a good deal of damage, but since there's no HP in real life, um, I think you just broke your leg. What? My whole leg? Yeah, your leg's broken now. Ow! Son of a bitch! Bilbo Schmiggins, do you know any healing magic? <laughs> my my um, leg is broken! <laughs> well, <clears throat> being a, a, a master... Carpenter. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I think I know how to do some some leg splints. Yeah, yeah, sure. Just like through on the job. Yeah, like, I'm gonna say that you can throw one of those together real fast, right, but you so need I'm the gonna, material for it though. Um, I just gotta look around, and I'm kind of in just in relative awe of yeah, all yeah. the <laughs> like the woodwork and the buildings. Like not really thinking too hard about it, just being like, "That's a lot of cool with buildings. These people would know what their stuff." <laughs> um, so I'm gonna do a investigation check for just like, well, see, I guess one thing I'm unclear of: investigation is like a very specific object, right? It's when you are trying to um, learn more about a certain thing. Learn. Okay. Um, then can I do a perception check mm -hmm. of the area, like in? Maybe with the idea of, is there any, like, like scraps of wood nearby? Yeah, for sure. I'm mainly looking for that. Um, why don't you, yeah, choose a number between 1 and 20. All right. Um, I'm pretty dazed. Mm -hmm. I, roll a, I roll a 7. 
I, I was thinking seven. <gasps> so you actually, uh, unfortunately, even with your your perfect Schmigan eyes, you see this place is pretty well taken care of. It's just you know wooden shops and whatnot. If you you really wanted some wood, you'd have to actually start taking it off of other things. Yeah, yeah I'm not about to start start doing that. I'm a I'm a mad on my word. <laughs> In my wood, <laughs> <laughs> I guess. Man of so, Bilbo Schmiggins, um, man of his wood. <laughs> <laughs> a man of mine. And so I, I turned to to look at Mark Wahlberg and I say, uh, "Mr. Wahlberg, I'm a man of my wood." What? And, <laughs> and I think we can get your leg in order, or at least to start with a nice splint. Uh, so we're gonna have to, like, if you can. If you can move, uh, I can try and, and help you you walk and get to some a place where there might be some wood to sell. Or uh, okay, you can just or if you can just or you just want to hang out here and I'll just. Um, I mean, I can limp it. Myself. You can limp it. Yeah. Okay, let's kind of move our way toward getting you some wood or something else we can maybe help you out with. <laughs> Towards getting me some wood. <laughs> we, gotta, we gotta get you some wood, Mr. Wahlberg. Ah, oh, Jesus. When you say that, uh, yeah, it actually seems to summon something, and, and uh, a small portal opens up nearby, and uh, a PA walks out with a, a small bundle of wood, and he, he pushes it into your arm and says, Here's your wood, Mr. Wahlberg! And he runs back into the portal and disappears. Whoa. What? Do I recognize who that was? Yeah, that was Jimmy. What the fuck? How He's did Jimmy son. get here? My son? He's your son, Jimmy. Why is my son Jim also... Robert. Why does he also work on, like, movie sets? <laughs> He's trying to break into it. Holy shit, alright. Be, be just like that. Uh, Mr. Mr. Wahlberg, I would have thought you would have, you know, just given your... Your children. Do I even do I know that that was his son? How much of a Mark Wahlberg fan am I? Oh man, you know what? If you're that big of a fan, I think you do. You know his whole family. <laughs> I, shit, that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh. you know, Mr. Wahlberg, you know, I would have thought that um, being a man of your status, you would just kind of give your son so much more. But now I see you giving him more than I can imagine. You're you're actually making him work. Well, I mean, I, I don't want to coddle him or anything. Wait a minute. You, you, How do you know my you son? You're a real uh, Wikipedia. What? <laughs> you, you know, Wikipedia. Well, uh, you, 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 can, you can read about stuff on Wikipedia and y yeah. you've got a pretty big page. Oh, I wrote it. Right. But I, I you mean, wrote it? <laughs> You wrote my Wikipedia page? How much uh, I mean, information I... did you put in his Wikipedia? <laughs> How much do you know? You, you know, I put a... You know, I just kind of added to your, your your personal life section just a little bit. Like, just a little. I He does that thing with his <laughs> eyes where they get real big, and he cocks his head to the side a little bit. You know the one. <laughs> that classic Mark Wahlberg look. Yes. <laughs> Uh, well, I mean, I'm, I'm a, pu a public figure like yourself, I mean, you got to understand that, you know, if you're that concerned, maybe you could pay your PR team a little bit more to kind of manage the pages themselves. You know, take out any information you might not want on there, like... Yeah, all right, I'll think about it. Let's just my son get... Uh... My son Jimmy? Okay, all right. Yeah, let, let's, 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 let's get let's, over let's to get wherever this wood is, yeah. This is ridiculous. <laughs> okay, um, like, like, is there a street with like buildings on it nearby? Yeah, yeah no, you that? guys are in the middle of this street. Okay, it's like I'm it's gonna... a, a classic, um, like long, uh, Edo period, uh, dirt road straight down with uh, shops lining either side, and it's a busy, it's a busy market street. Like I said, there, you know, there are some off-duty samurai walking by. There's um peasants with their carts and stuff like that 
Okay, let's see. Well, I mean, I guess oh, I forgot actually we do have the wood. What, Kim? I don't have the shop for it. <laughs> you, you haven't um, been around for this? Kim, we're deep inside of a a, a D and D game right now. Um, I, I'm gonna try my pockets. Do I have any like rope or like t like twine or anything on me? Um, I don't think so, but. You do have a weapon. What is it? <gasps> um, I do have a weapon. It's uh, the the ro the road is is tough, so I've I've just got a Smith and Wesson um, gun. <laughs> gun. Yes, the very powerful uh, yeah, Smith and Wesson a, gun. A, uh, yes, that a, one, the Smith and Wesson gun. <laughs> what does I, gun it, stand for? It, I assume it, it's an it, acronym, it, it, right? It could be held in one hand. Yeah, it does actually. It is actually an acronym. Very yeah. Bad. Um, it stands for uh, <laughs> gets you nice. <laughs> what? <laughs> My, my Smith and Wesson gets you nice weapon <laughs> in my pocket. Oh. <laughs> do yeah, do so I have you, a gun? You reach into your pocket for some twine and you pull out the gets you nice. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, <laughs> uh, Mark Wahlberg, you also have a weapon. It's weird. What's in there? Uh, I just figured I would have, like, I don't know, a Glock or something. So you, you also have a gun on you. Yeah, I figured Mark okay. Wahlberg probably carries a pistol of some kind. All right, so what, is, what, is the, what does Glock stand for? What? It's a... It's it's an acronym, right? No, it's the name of a... It's definitely an acronym. Okay, uh, it's... You're right. It's definitely an acronym. <laughs> it stands yeah, for... Yeah, it is. Um, good luck on Cox, kid. <laughs> I mean, that's. So this isn't so like much a weapon as gun it is. does, right? Huh? Like, like you're talking about like the cox a gun does, right? Um. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I was gonna say, so this isn't so much a weapon as it is a sex tool. Um. No. I mean, it. Every time I pull the slide back manually, yeah, it gives yeah. me extra luck for the next oh. shot. Okay, yeah. But I can only do that the first time I use it because okay. I don't oh. have to pull the slide back after that because it goes <laughs> on its own, you know? All right, so uh, if as long as you got you got extra fun flavor for your Glock, I'll, I'll go back to uh, Bilbo Schmiggins and ask, what does the Get You Nice do? <laughs> um, I mean, <clears throat> when, it, when it fires... And it connects with the the target. You know, it gets them nice. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> so yeah, you know, it, 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 it just it just delivers whatever um, amount of damage that is equal to the target's max HP. What? <laughs> I mean, to be fair, that pretty much does sound like a gun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, yeah. <laughs> okay. But I want to be specific about this. Yeah. It does do a con a concrete. That's not concrete in fantasy. It does a clear number of fat of damage uh, to the target. Yeah. And that is whatever that target's max HP is. Yeah, all That's right. That's its mechanic. Yeah, okay. That sounds great. Martin, you fucked up. <laughs> Your gun sucks. <laughs> whatever. I just, it's, a, it's a fucking gun. I wasn't going to make it overpowered. <laughs> <clears throat> and wouldn't you know, just as you find these weapons, one of those samurai actually takes a stand at you and starts yelling at you in Japanese. And you, you recognize it as Japanese, but you don't understand what he's saying. Um, what do you do? Mitsubishi, um, uh, Toyota, <laughs> Yamaha. God, I don't know Japanese at all. Do you know any Japanese? I'm saying that to, to Bilbo. Bilbo uh, Honda? Uh, fuck. Honda? <laughs> he, it seems uh, to recognize that name, that name Honda. Uh, yeah, Honda. Yeah, ha Honda, Honda. Honda. I, my it? hands are up. My hands are up. <laughs> And I'm like, you know, still limping a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Um, he he relaxes a little bit and he he uh, takes his hand off of his sword, 
and he approaches you and and uh, like puts his hand on your shoulder and starts to lead you. Do you follow? Uh, on my shoulder? Yeah. Well, I kind of have to because he's pulling me and I'm limping. So like I I just kind of go along with it, I guess. <laughs> okay. Yeah. He actually he notices you limping and he he like grabs your arm and and allows you to support your your body weight with him. Oh, thanks, buddy. Oh yeah. What? <laughs> oh yeah. Because <laughs> that's that's yeah that's how they do. Uh, it. I just kind of lean in and say, oh yeah. <laughs> he looks at you and says, <laughs> I look over at at Bilbo and like do the cut it out gesture. Uh, I just kind of shapely look at the ground and just walk with you guys. So as he uh, as you're walking with him, he's he's continuing to talk. He he you don't get it whatsoever. Every now and then you do recognize the word Honda, and you're moving away from the market street. Um, it's further and further away. The, the the crowd is thinning, and eventually you see um, just sort of sprawling out in front of you a, a massive estate. Um, it's, it's gigantic. It's, you know, beautiful Japanese gardens as far as the eye can see and multiple, uh, outbuildings and one huge, um, main building in classic Japanese architecture. He, he takes you to, to the, the, the entrance and he exchanges a few words with the guards that are stationed there. And then he turns back to you and he says something and walks away. Uh, hey, what what are we supposed to do, guy? I I I, I don't know, man. Uh, okay. Well, now what? So, where exactly are we right now? You're at the entrance. There's a big wall around the property. Okay. There are two guards stationed in front of you, but they don't see. They're they're looking at you weird, but they're not stopping you at all. Uh, should we just go in? Uh, that's what I think would be a good idea. Let's okay. Go so we start going in. Okay. Uh, you make your way through. Is there anywhere you, you're heading specifically? Because it's a huge place. Okay. Um, let's see. What can I see in the general area? Um, you see, like I said, a number of, like, beautiful rock gardens with, like, you know, ponds and, um, and little, you know, bamboo. Okay bits and pieces and it's just a very nice uh japanese garden imagine do you remember the uh uh what was it called we went there with anime club in whitewater the like chicago japanese garden it's like that i don't think i went on that trip really i thought you did if i did i just don't remember it which hmm. would be a shame that's not great anyway just you know you know japanese gardens it's a really yes. nice yeah. japanese garden um, and interspersed through all of this, there are a number of, of buildings. Some are smaller, some are bigger. Um, but if you follow the main path, it leads um, directly to the largest building in the property. Uh, Mr. Walver, do you think we should head to that largest building <laughs> in the property? Uh... I figure that's probably where that's probably where he wants us to go. Okay. Or or we can check out some. All right, let's go. You know, use your use your star power to just kind of have us walk right in. You 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 keep you keep the pace and the swagger as as best you can. Uh, no no offense intended, just you know you. Yeah, you I'm it. swagging a little bit. <laughs> I roll my eyes. I'll uh, I'll follow right behind you. Okay. All right, and you're heading to the main building then. Yeah, I guess we're just walking right in. Yeah, you are. It it works. It, like no one stops you. You've been allowed inside. Right? Holy shit! This is this is fine. Um, you you make your way to the the main entrance, and it's it's big and it's grand, and the doors slide open, and a a woman in a very prim and proper kimono greets you in Japanese, and uh, sort of motions gently um, into the building and begins walking in that direction uh we follow her i guess yeah okay she leads you through the hallways everything is wonderful <laughs> <laughs> and, 
and eventually she leads you to a a large open room uh, where there is a small table and a few pillows on the ground and gestures at the table and says a few things in Japanese. Uh, you know, this Japanese mechanic really helps me not have to make make up, you know, dialogue conversation. Yeah, it yeah. sure does. Uh, I guess yeah, we better right. sit down then. And I sit down at the table. I sit myself as well. Okay. After waiting for a few minutes, um, the door slides open on the other side of the room, and you hear, Oh, what the hell? And you look over, and it's Grandpa. Grandpa, you son of a bitch. What did you do to us? No, what, what did I do? What did you do? How did you get into my world? Uh, uh, what are you talking about? You sent us here. You're my employer. I you have no right to be inside of my personal space. What? You started beating up this guy here. That doesn't sound like me. Uh, I saw you do it. No. Uh, so, so did I. Look, that doesn't. Uh, if I, if okay, if I, if I did that out there, then I obviously had a good reason for it. Oh, I didn't think so. That he doesn't wasn't give doing you anything any wrong. Right to come into my personal world. Look, man, I don't want to be here. Okay, everybody's speaking Japanese. What is this? Yeah, this. Well, this is. You don't. Okay, look, like this is this is my my fantasy. All right, like this is this is just my thing. This is my thing. All right, this don't don't no judgment. You're fucking Mark Wahlberg. I know what you're up to. So like, don't judge. All right. Look, I'm not judging. This is your. How am I inside your fantasy? I don't know. How the fuck did you get in here? <laughs> this is not on me. This is on you. No one's ever come in here before. This is definitely on you because I didn't do this it is anything. This definitely on you. No, it's not. I'm, I'm going to have, I, you know, I'm unionized, right? I'm going to have a talk oh my with, God. With, my, with my union leader about how my boss apparently invaded my, my personal insides. I don't want to be inside you, okay? Is that a gun? Did you bring a gun into my insides? Look, I just I I just carry a gun. I don't think it's a big deal. Look, look you know Jimmy, Grandpa was or you know <laughs> Jimmy. You know Grandpa, Jimmy yeah, was so you, you, you say that and the portal opens. Yeah, boss. Uh, oh and, yeah, and I, Grandpa looks at Oh, I what the hell? You're here too. That, that's all. And now you hear two again. Uh hey, Jimmy, can you get us out of here? What what is this? How did I get in here? Oh, yeah, sure, boss. And he, he just, like, you know, he's still standing by the portal and just stands next to it. Like, I mean, go ahead. Uh, uh, and Grandpa looks at you and says, get the fuck out of here. Okay, we're going. We're going. I, I go into uh, the portal. All right. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm following, too. All right. You both enter the portal. And uh, it empties you out back in the Wahlburger. <laughs> where's where's grandpa he's nowhere to be seen fuck uh is jimmy there jimmy's not there either god damn it is is bilbo there yeah bilbo's there okay oh my god dude what was that i'm, I'm saying to bilbo uh i wish i could tell you <sighs> and where the hell is grandpa I'm sorry, I don't know if I have anything left. <laughs> oh. oh. I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry. I think you re I think I've reached my peak. Okay, well you better you better write something cuz I want a conclusion to the story now. <laughs> Kim, what was that? <laughs> Kim wants to know what happens next. Yeah. <laughs> we can't just leave after all that. <laughs> okay, how about we refuse to go? How about we let's back up? Let's refuse to have left. Okay, all right. You, you're refusing to go. Uh, are, you, are you okay with this, Martin? I mean, I, Mark Wahlberg wouldn't refuse to leave. He wants out of there. You have to be true to the character. Yeah, okay. he wants to get the fuck out of whatever this crazy world he's in and and okay. go back right, to his normal. I'll do it like this, then. I'll do it like this. Um, okay. Jimmy says, yeah, sure. Like, yeah, go go, go ahead. And he stands aside from the portal. Uh -huh. and, and I go to get in the portal. You, you just walk right into it. It's like it's a, a solid 2D object. Oh, ow. What the? F uh, but, hey, hey, uh, hey, dad boss, you, you you having some trouble there? What What is this? Jimmy, how did you even get in here? 
Why, it's the portal you gave me. Uh, what? When did I give you a portal? From my 18th birthday. You said it was because I was a man now. <sighs> God damn it. Men get portals. Okay. Uh, shit. You said when I turn 21, you're going to give me a Glock like you have. But I kind of like what Bill Bush Miggins has because it's a real one. It's a good gun. What are you talking about? Glock's a real His gun. His gun just kills people. Well, <laughs> I mean, this one would too, I guess. If I... You think so? Yeah. Why not? You said it was, you said it was a a good luck with cocks or something like that. Well, yeah, like every time you cock it, you get good luck so you can shoot it better. Look, it doesn't matter. Oh my god, is that what that means? <sighs> I thought you were gay this whole time. <laughs> Jimmy, or, how I mean, do I use fine. this? Like, I don't I don't mind if you are. Like, I just... Uh, uh, Jimmy, he's not. I would have put that on his Wikipedia page. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy, how do I use the portal? Why, why am I just walking into it? Oh, I think you got to click E on it, boss. What? I got to yeah, click E, like E for use, the use key. Uh, yeah, like this. And he walks over to it and clicks E and he disappears into the portal. What the fuck? Mark Wahlberg, you got one of those E keys? Um, try, it on your, try it on your smartphone. Okay. Pull my phone out and I open a text so that I can pull the keyboard up and I press E. Okay. Um, who are you sending that to? Um, uh, the last person I texted was, we'll say, my producer on whatever movie I'm working on. Mm, what movie is it? Uh, Go Fuck Yourself Forever 5. What were the first four like? They're, they're a series of, like, action films where yeah. I play a guy who just, like, hates everyone <laughs> he just, yeah he tells everyone to go fuck themselves and yeah. then they get mad and an action scene happens all right cool. and that's the whole that's the whole film for sure yeah so you send it to dom your producer of uh <laughs> go fuck yourself five and it just it says it couldn't be sent so okay you look carefully you have no bars here this is ancient japan grandpa looks at you and goes the fuck are you doing Look, I'm just trying to get out of here, okay? This isn't a fucking video game or something. I don't know how he, like, pressed E and left. Look, I don't know how he left, and I don't know how you're planning to leave, but if you don't leave soon, I'm gonna make you leave. Oh, okay. What are you gonna do? Guards! And the, the doors fly open, and a bunch of heavily armed samurai walk into the room with their swords brandished. Shit. Roll for initiative. <laughs> God damn it. Give me a number between 1 and 20. Um, I roll 17. All right, Bilbo? I roll a 2. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Bilbo goes first, then the samurai, and then uh, and then Mark Wahlberg. <laughs> Fuck. So, Bilbo, you, you have, I'll say, eight armed samurai bearing down on you. Um, and Grandpa is standing behind them. What do you do? <laughs> <laughs> Who's standing behind me, Grandpa? No, not behind you, behind them. Oh, okay. Eight armed um, samurai bearing down on you, Grandpa eight, behind them. Wait, 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 eight armed samurai or an eight armed samurai? <laughs> <laughs> eight armed samurai. Like, okay. there, there are eight of them. They have um, two arms. I'm gonna point my. I'm gonna <laughs> aim at Grandpa. Okay. And and and, and use <laughs> gun. <laughs> use the Smith and Wesson gun. I'm gonna use the Smith and Wesson gun. Okay. Um. <laughs> you pull the trigger at Grandpa, <laughs> and you see a little number above his head that says uh, 92. And then another red number that says 92 as you shoot Grandpa in the face. <laughs> and, and he dies. Dude, what? Why did you kill him? I mean, he, was, he wasn't a very good employee now, was he? He, he, was, he unionized Mr. Wahlberg. Ah, oh, shit, that's right. I hate unions. <laughs> Okay, but, like, how are we going to get out of here now? Uh, we were chatting about this, but uh, 
now that Grandpa is dead, this place starts to destabilize. Um, everything starts to get a little bit like wavy. Like the lines are no longer straight. They're they're moving slightly, and it's sort of like it looks like like an optical illusion as like the 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 armed samurai they they stop moving and they too like their edges start to slowly wave back and forth like like scan lines on a tv like like an old uh cool. antenna tv and as their like their lines are waving back and forth they start to overlap each other ever so slightly and then there's a flash and standing before you is now a large eight-armed samurai Shit. Are, are we still in initiative? You are. Two of the arms swing at Mark Wahlberg. Does... F fuck? <laughs> does, does, does two swords hit? <laughs> um, probably. I mean, I can try to get out of the way, but one of Your my legs, legs is broken. broken so... <laughs> which, which leg is broken? Right or left? Um, we'll say it's the left leg. Okay. Uh, so then it's your, your left injured leg that, uh, takes these two sword hits. Um, they are large swords. This is a <laughs> large samurai. Uh, your leg comes off. Ah! Uh, Bilbo Schmiggins, when you look over at Mark Wahlberg's leg being taken off, you see a, a, a red number that says 12 above his head. <laughs> Before fading away. Mark Wahlberg, it's your turn. Um, I'm going to shoot him with the Glock. <clears throat> All right. Which means I have to cock it. Yes, you cock the Glock. And then what happens? My luck on this next shot increases. So I have a higher this to hit. This one that you're about to shoot. Yes. Okay. All right. Um, so you're, who are you shooting? The eight-armed samurai. Okay, just checking. Um, you, you pull out the, the, the Glock and you, you cock it and you fire a shot at the samurai and, um, nothing happens. But when you look down, you can see a four-leaf clover. What? That's not how that's supposed to work. I don't know, it seems pretty lucky to find a four-leaf clover. That's what he says out loud. Oh. Because he's... And then that's what the samurai says out loud. Wow, that seems pretty lucky. What? Find a four-leaf clover. Fuck you! <laughs> Can I use my reaction to hit him with the pistol? Yeah, sure. Okay, I just hit him with the pistol because I'm so mad. As, like, the, the samurai is bending over to, to pick up this four-leaf clover because you're leaving it there. Um, and as soon as he plucks it out of the ground, he starts to glow, and uh, you you smack him with the 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 Glock, and the Glock dissolves into four leaf clovers and poofs into the wind. Uh, 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 he's he's speechless. He has no idea that guns aren't supposed <laughs> to behave like this. <laughs> Bilbo Schmiggins, it's your turn. I am Samui in shock. Good old Bilbo Schmakins. <laughs> Where some of the events that have taken place. Yeah. Um. Wow. Uh, similarly inspired, I'm also going to look for four-leaf clovers. Yeah. Okay. I mean, you see uh, the, the you see the ones that are that are floating away that were once uh, the Glock. Um, but they seem intangible, actually. They sort of like they sort of like clip through the walls as they float away. <laughs> okay, so so I like I, I reach out to grab one and yeah. it just like my hand passes right through it. Yeah, it, it does. Oh, okay, that's a bummer. Um, I could say you you tried to do that as like a bonus action. Okay, yeah, that is my bonus action. I, okay. I tried my best to get the, the clover. Yeah, and what's your action? What are you gonna do? Um. <clears throat> See, uh, as a carpenter, I'm going to go ahead and say I've got uh, carpenter's tools on me. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to reach into my, my tool belt and uh, get out some measuring tape. Yeah. And I'm going to just kind of... Oh, sorry, I've been maybe only 75% paying attention. Is the 8 arm Samurai still around? 
<laughs> yes, <laughs> yeah, he's still there. He didn't... Okay, okay, I'm gonna, he's I'm gonna try glowing. and I'm, he's just glowing. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna attempt to measure one of his arms. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Roll me a measuring check. A number between one and twelve. Carpenter measurement check. Yeah. Uh, I'll give you advantage on it range? though because you're a carpenter. What's, what's the number range? Uh, one to twenty. All right. Um. Well, this is a 25 foot uh, measuring tape. Yeah. As it turns out. Yeah. Um, so I roll, uh, that's a, that's a, I'm rolling a 20 and okay. um, my, mod, my measuring modifier is plus five. So that's a 25. Okay. So the number I was thinking of was five. <laughs> <laughs> and um, you, you reach out, you, you, you sort of like, you start at the shoulder right because that's like the firmest part um of the samurai as you know are you sure it's the firmest part of the samurai <laughs> at the moment it oh. is uh, maybe i should get the, the glock out the again <laughs> I started the shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> and i'll try a different you cock. Start, you start on you start on unreeling this this measuring tape down the samurai's arm and uh as her reaction um, a single sword comes from the other side and uh, cuts into your measuring tape <gasps> and cuts it in half. <gasps> the, rest uh, of it, the, rest of, the rest of it sort of zoops back into the, the canister as it is wont to do. But now that it's only half long, I don't think you can, you can get it back out. It's fully wound inside. Damn. <sighs> I, uh, I, I cast aside my, my measuring tape. Yeah. And I guess I, uh, uh, do I still have movement on this turn? Yeah, you can move. All right. I'm going to, I'm going to move back 10 feet. All right. You have backed 10 feet away from the eight armed samurai. Uh, it's now the eight armed samurai's turn and he spends his turn glowing stronger. He spends his whole turn gl glowing and he gets, uh, the glow gets stronger. Wow. It feels like a JR beach. You can feel the energy building up. Mark Wahlberg, what do you do? I don't know. I I really don't know. My gun didn't work at all. Um my leg's broken. I don't <laughs> know. Cut. I'm pretty strong. It's and cut oh yeah. <laughs> my leg is just gone now. Um Yeah. I mean check your pockets. What do you got in there? I have I don't know. I, I guess I might have, like, keys for my right. car. Yeah, dog. Pull out your keys. How many keys you got on there? Um, uh, I'm going to say there's just, like, three keys. Three keys? What are they for? One's for the car. One is for, yeah. like, whatever house I'm living in right now. Yeah. And the other one is... uh, Fuck, I don't know. It's a, it's a key for a sex dungeon. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, so you pull out these these three keys of yours, um, and they they seem to be actually um, different than the last time you saw them. Uh, each of them looks sort of thematically different um, in a way that would be reminiscent of their purpose. Okay. So, yeah. like, what are they for now? No, no, no. Like, they're for the same things. Oh, just like one looks like, you know, a BDSM key. It's got like leather wrapped around it. Oh, um, I see. So one, the other one actually the, looks uh, like my Lamborghini. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. The house one, it's got a little window on it. And <laughs> oh um, the uh, car one, when you when you touch it, it honks. Uh, he frowns and recoils a little bit when it honks. Okay. So what do you do with the keys? Um, I throw the sex dungeon key at the samurai. <laughs> you throw the sex dungeon key at the samurai, and as it contact, as it makes contact, it bursts into rope, and it starts to lash itself around the eight-armed samurai, and it binds it in that, uh, that Japanese, uh, like, like, stringing up bdsm play fashion <laughs> okay and he's uh by, by the time it's done he's 
hanging from the roof of this uh, of this room that you're in, and he is tied in intricate ways, intricate knots. Each arm is is folded behind him, and his dick is fully out. <laughs> it's wow. normal size. Oh, okay. Good. I'm glad that it's normal size. Yeah. Is this and erect, though. Very. Oh, it's it's completely hard. Completely. All right, that's your turn, I suppose, unless yeah. you want to move. Um, can I, like, move away from him? Yeah. All right, I do that. What's he going to do? I don't know. Everything that ha that's happened so far doesn't make any sense, and I'm afraid he'll, like, get out of it or something. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, all right, then Bilbo Schmiggins. What do you do? Um... I mean, so so. Uh, no, I, I really Mark Wahlberg can't. doesn't have his gun. You do have your gun. I, I do have my gun. It's true. Um, yeah. <laughs> the Smith and Weston gun. Guess, I guess. Yeah. I guess. Um, I'm assuming that the uh, the samurai is member is fairly uh, still. Like it's maybe twitching a little bit, but it's generally not moving yeah. much. Yeah, 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 yeah. Twitching yeah, a lot uh, actually, but yeah. <laughs> I, I'm gonna. Well, I'm gonna just like shoot. <laughs> I'm gonna the base of uh, of the shaft. Yeah, the, the, the fixed point where it's probably not moving all that much. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna use use gun. Okay. At, yeah. At the base of the dick. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh <my> <laughs> yep. Yeah, yeah. Um. So you do you move in close to do this, or is this like a like a uh, a deagle from across the McDonald's oh God, parking lot situation? Walk straight into it. <laughs> <laughs> I, press, I press the barrel against just the base of his <laughs> So what do you say oh, as you pull the trigger? Uh, I say, fuck you forever, <laughs> dick. <laughs> and I wink at Mark Wahlberg. I roll my eyes so hard. <laughs> you pull the trigger and the dick blasts straight off of the body. <laughs> and... <laughs> <laughs> As it sort of like cartwheels through the air in slow motion, uh, the the camera pans out and you see the whole room. It actually kind of cuts between. Um, it shows the samurai's face um, in agony. Then it cuts to Mark Wahlberg's face. What's your face doing? A disgusted and surprised look. Okay. Then it, it goes back to uh, Bilbo Schmiggin's face. What is Bilbo's face doing? Um... Just grinning ear to ear. Okay. And is he doing it, the it, Jack Nicholson grinning, nodding thing? Oh, <laughs> yes, yes, he is. <laughs> that's, the worst, that's the worst face you can have right now. It's Thank the you. best face. <laughs> For when you're shooting a giant samurai's yes! dick off. Yes. yes. <laughs> so, in, yeah, in, the, the, in fact, <clears throat> um, what's his name? Uh, what's my character's name? Bilbo Schmiggins. He spent yeah. way too much time on the internet, so in fact, he is just imitating that gif. Yeah, okay. The best of his ability. All right, so the camera cuts around to all the reaction faces, and then it pans out to a wide shot of the of the three of you. It kind of looks like a, a JRPG angle, and uh, above the, uh, the tied-up giant samurai's head, you see a big red number that says 9999, and the samurai uh, dissolves into four-leaf clovers, and they flip their way out of the room. <laughs> All right. Oh, my God. Uh, Bill Schmiggins tries to collect them yet again. Okay. They Actually, you know what? You try to collect them as they clip out of the room, and this time you can. You collect as many as you can grab. Okay, so I just got a handful of four leaf clovers then. Yeah, you've got a handful of four leaf clovers and All right. um your body begins to glow. <laughs> and as your body begins to glow, you become uh perfectly aware of your surroundings, of this house. Suddenly you know every crevice, every detail, you know every room, every servant's name, you know Japanese, you know everything about this world that you're in and you understand that it belongs to you now. 
Oh my god. Meanwhile, uh, Mark Wahlberg is just like sitting on the ground shaking his head. Uh, I have to forget the Japanese word for world. Um, <laughs> what do you know? What do you know? What do you know? Oh my god. Uh, Mark, Mark, Mark Wahlberg. <laughs> Uh, it's a, it's a, uh... What? Uh, 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 Are you okay? <laughs> what, what is happening right now? <laughs> what do you do with this newfound power? What is the first action that you have in oh, control man. of this this world that you are in? Uh, I summon all the versions of Mark Wahlberg from all of Mark Wahlberg's acting roles <laughs> into the room. Um, tell me, explain. How many are there and what are they uh, from? At least... At least ten main acting roles. Yeah. For sure. Like, you know, they're all basically the same carbon copy of, yeah. you know, fuck you forever action hero yeah. man. <laughs> okay. Um... Uh, Actually, no, 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 I'm thinking if there's five Fuck You Forever, no, there's four Fuck You for, Forever yeah. movies, and there's right. uh, the two Transformers ones he was in. That's six. Yep, yep, okay. Uh, there might be at least 15 of these guys. Yeah, yeah. Um, And then, like, he's played, like, at least, like, 20-bit roles, so, like, I sure. imagine there's, like, you know, 15 of the big machismo posturing ones. yeah. Uh, two of them do have the alien guns from the Transformers films. Good. <laughs> Generic <laughs> alien guns. He has yeah, them. for sure. Um, and then there are like just 20 in the background just kind of like flexing and looking a little bit confused. And they're not confused because of the surroundings. Like, that's just how he acted. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. Wow. So that's happening. Okay. Mark Wahlberg, what do you have to do? Um, I... <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea what's happening. All of a sudden, I am in the room. There's like me's everywhere. I don't mm -hmm. know. I he has no idea. All right. He's speechless. So uh, I'm I'm just gonna say this. Um, you live here now. Um, throughout the rest of your days, you you never find a way to leave this world. You you live here for the rest of your lives. So give me a quick lowdown about how you spend the rest of your lives. I, I'm I'm just curious. Does um, Bill Bosch Megan's inherently know the exit to this world? No. No. Okay. No. There is no exit. <laughs> um. After um, he you killed the exit. Yeah. After <laughs> after realizing oh, that he's resigned to live in this world forever, Mark Wahlberg yeah. uh, tr shoots himself with the Glock. <laughs> in the head so Do you cock it first um yeah you know what he does for luck he cocks yeah. it what happens yeah. does he die um <laughs> boy what does luck mean in this situation that's a good question you you cock the gun question. you aim it at your head and you shoot um and instead of anything you know death sort of stuff happening um you become sort of overwhelmed you feel a power welling out from from you and the last thing oh, that no. i think I, th I think the last thing that we we see of your character um in this in this world is you shouting persona oh, no. <laughs> and oh no <laughs> and then sort of a fade to black for your character wow and <laughs> what does bilbo schmiggins do he is similarly inspired, and he shouts Persona, <laughs> and aims the gun at his head, and fires. Oh yeah. no! It's like a bomb goes off. <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly, the room fills with Mark Wahlberg's. <laughs> Four of them. Like, but not just, not just every movie actor, not every movie character he's ever played, but, like, every possible Mark Wahlberg from any reality. You know, the, the, the Mark Wahlberg from the reality where he decided not to go to acting school and he became a roofer in Boston. You know? Like, that guy's here. Um, the reality 
where uh you know he he decided to not uh he, he decided against the, the starring role in the Transformers movie, and now he's a highly respected actor doing extremely, uh, like, highbrow entertainment with um, uh, Martin Scorsese. You Amazing. know, all of them. All of them are here. Yeah. Um, infinite and beautiful. And that's the end. Good job, everyone. <laughs> that was amazing. That was great. Thank you, Dan. <laughs> For that thank you, and thank that you guys. That was more than I expected it to be. Yeah, I it, bet. it absolutely was.